going on, Miss Dale? Oh, What's going on with you? No. No, we're not talking about that. What are we talking about? Look. I feel like. I feel like you should ask me, man. How no. You <laughs> ask the motherfucker how we're they We're talking feel. about bouncing on penis. Exactly. So ask the motherfucker how they want their dick roll. Have you ever asked it before? Have you I don't give a fuck how they want their dick roll. I'm going to write it how I want it. Garrett, please yourself. Fuck you. <laughs> they might not want it, so they might want. They fuck. might want that shit fast. They might want to get the fuck out of my vagina. What's good? It's Miss Dead. Thanks for tuning back into my channel. It's hella lit. Today we're gonna learn how to ride that dick. You heard? A lot of motherfuckers were in my last video about all this wall shit. We're not virgins in this motherfucker, okay? And I'm helping all these motherfucking sisters out here who don't know how to ride dick because that was one for me. I did not know how to ride dick. And I was embarrassed. So I'm here to help everybody learn how to hop on that dick. Yeah? First step to riding dick is you wanna be confident, you wanna be comfortable, and you wanna be relaxed. The last thing you want is hard dick going in a dry ass vagina. Like, you know when you're overthinking something and you know, you be super horny and then you're like, oh my God, well, what if my stomach's showing? Or what if you don't think I'm very good? Then you start getting dry, er? Cause it happened to me. Like, I don't know if I'm doing a good job and I'm just not, my vagina's not all the way, you know, up to par like it should be, er? So be confident. And how to do that too, if you're like insecure about your body, get some lingerie, get a blindfold, blindfold his ass up so he don't even see shit, turn off the lights, get drunk, smoke some weed if that's what you do, like relax because he's gonna fucking like anything. You can hop on his dick and he already coming, you heard? After you get your mental preparation all there, uh, it's time for some techniques. So the most popular one has to be cowgirl. And it's like this. So uh, the guy's body is there and you're on top. You want to put your hands on his chest. I love when my hands are on his chest. It just makes me feel, I don't know, bomb. Or you can put your hands on the bed. But when it's on the chest, you're going to go up and down. And... Like, think about your favorite song in your head, how it has like a rhythm. You want to go up and down to that rhythm. It's going to help you stay concentrated and not go everywhere. So, like this. Please me, baby. Turn around and just tease me, baby. Like that. So, how I was going to consistency the whole time. And from the cowgirl, you can also go up and down. So you can go like this. And that's another one. And you always want to keep the same rhythm. Or you can lean back and grind like this. And do like that too. And they can see like your breast moving and everything. So I really like that one. It is it's very sexy. You don't even know what you don't even have to know what you're doing to do that. It's just small. Another position that you can do is the reverse cowgirl. So if his body, if his head's laying over here, you want to turn your body the opposite way and do the same thing. Like just ride his dick. You can go in circles. I like going in circles. And then I like going like that one when I get tired like flexing my butt cheeks and then you can still go up and down and do that and make sure that you're keeping your rhythm like that and everything will be fine once you know once you establish this rhythm you can do so much more like do the splits on the dick and everything this is a very important way on how to ride dick these this position will have you burning so many fucking calories in the lap, like the five minutes that he's about to come. Because you go on your legs like this. You'll go like this. And then you'll just bounce like that. And that one is probably the easiest slash hardest. Because if you don't have balance, first off, our good leg muscles 
you're not lasting long in that position. But they love that position. And it's just so easy to coach. And now we're gonna go on to three tips that'll just like really, really help you with everything from this point on in the bedroom and everything. One, remember to please yourself. So when you're riding dick, you're not riding dick for him. You're riding dick for you. Do you think he gives a fuck about how you feel when he's fucking you? 90% of the time, no. So bitch, please yourself. Number two, be creative. So when you're up there and you know, if you're shy, like I said, get that blindfold out, get that lingerie out, get your panties, wrap around his hand. It'll make you feel so much better and it just sex be so much more better for you. Like get your phone out and record. Uh, instead of doing the basic bounce up, why don't you just twerk on that day? Why don't you just once in a while do the splits on that day? Have a baby on that day. And the last one, I can't stress this enough, is to relax. Relax, because trust me, you're doing fine, and to him, you're probably doing amazing. Because most girls don't even want to ride. So, really fucking relax, you heard? Because they might be like, this is my future baby mama, and you like, damn, I can't wait to go fuck home. Teamwork, baby. Teamwork. Look, I'm gonna guide you, and I want to strong that shit. I'm trying to hold them waist and shit. I'm trying to hold the waist and uh, grab the pants. You got me, damn. <laughs> <laughs> Man, shit. Dude, man. Damn. Look, okay. I only want you to ride it fast when I'm out the net. Other than that, man, ride that shit. Slow down. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> you feel me? Okay, so what do you do when they're about to nut, though? Do you, like, like crack down harder? I'm like, off and say I'm tired. What? <laughs> you better keep running to <laughs> like, no, I'm like, I'm tired. Oh, so when you're on top, do you, like, use your, uh, what's that shit called? Do you use the muscle to squeeze, squeeze the shit? Like, the, the, what's it called? You know what I'm You don't know when the girl squeeze your shit? It's called the, uh. Ooh.